there this is gonna be a spoiler free review of Candyman. I, I'd love to talk about the new Candyman because I have I have some mixed feelings about it. I thought that it was a really beautiful film. I mean, it looked great. I thought the performances were pretty good. I thought there were a few moments that kind of stuck out to me where I was like, oh, this this isn't, I don't know why this was performed this way or why they went with this cut or whatever. But there were a few, few moments in it that um, uh, mixed opinion, it was a masterpiece. Whoa. <laughs> masterpiece? Damn, your bar for masterpieces is I you know, then I've had my nephew put some masterpieces on my refrigerator before. <laughs> no, I see my thing is like with reviews, I always I don't just like to beat the shit out of projects, right? Because I think almost all projects have like a lot of things about them that make them you know, uh, good works, right? You know, like I, I, I'm never someone just, uh, I'm never someone who just sits down and looks at someone's like, uh, you know, intellectual property and just shits on it. All right. And, and that's not, that's not my take. And I think there's a lot about Candyman that I pretty much, you know, enjoyed. Uh, also, I'm pretty sure wasn't Candyman's director, like a first or second time director. I think, it, I think it was like, their first or second project to, to which it, I mean, that is enormously impressive. Um, second. Okay. That's what I thought. Um, she's doing captain Marvel two Now she'll do a great job with captain Marvel two. So Candyman, uh, I can reveal this. It's, it, it's basically out there already. It's not a spoiler, but basically Candyman is doing what Halloween did where this is a continuation of the original Candyman story instead of a full reboot. And they're throwing out kind of ladder pieces of the canon that um, don't really fit what they're trying to do. Uh, very similar to what they did with the the Halloween um, continuation. And I, and I like that, right? Because I, I really enjoy the original Candyman project. I think it's a very cool uh horror film and and i liked a lot uh within it um so it's cool to see some of the original ideas and and um characters come back in whatever form they come back in um this film it I, i'm going to be honest it's interesting it's not a very scary film um it, the 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 first kills that you see in the film are by far the most graphic and then there is kind of like a descending level of horror in the film and what eventually kind of amounts to like more of action um and the, the interesting thing about this film is it's not a horror film it's a superhero origin story. And I'm not giving anything away, but Candyman is a superhero origin story, which is why I fully understand why she's been given Marvel or Captain Marvel 2. Yeah, it's uh it's a it's a super it's a superhero that basically slaughters cops. Uh which, you know, uh um but uh you know it, it it feels uh uh strange at certain points i feel like the story kind of folds in on itself and certain elements are like put out there but never really explained and certain things about it feel kind of unjust and Certain commentary feels a little unearned. I didn't dislike this film. I thought it was a cool film. I don't think it is a film like uh, I think a lot of people thought it would. It would kind of be the second coming of Get Out and be like one of these intellectual pieces that like it stays with you for for months and months afterward. Um, I don't think Candyman kind of uh, ascended into that. Uh, that that masterpiece echelon.
but it was certainly a fun movie. Uh, I thought it was well acted. I felt like there were a few scenes in it that I felt were a little, a little goofy. I don't want to say outright what they were because I don't want to spoil it for anyone. It's a brand new film. Um, but there are a few things where I was like, come on now. Better or worse than the original? That's really tough because the original is kind of like a really fun, like camp horror. Uh, and I and I love the original um, for what it is. And the new one is much more of like an intellectual, you know, uh, contemplation of, of gentrification and uh, police brutality within Chicago and... I am going to give Candyman what I would refer to as a generous, generous 8 out of 10. I don't know. Uh, it's worth seeing. You guys tell me what you think. And and if you enjoyed the hell out of this film, again, my, my take is don't let my take ruin your enjoyment. I, I thought it was a perfectly passable film that was very pretty and well-performed. And uh, for a sophomore project of a director, damn impressive. I'm a stuck. But uh, just, not, just not the greatest project. Shit for me.